Back in 2020, the Buffs were running wild over the Arizona Wildcats. Broussard has ripped off another big one, 75 yards earlier, 59 here. Rushing for over 400 yards, the runs were made possible by CU center Joshua Gines. The big man led the team that day and was soon looking to lead another group on campus. I didn't look into it because I just assumed every college had, you know, fraternities, so black fraternities and sororities. When I got on campus, I was looking for it. They was like, they didn't have it. What he was looking for was Omega Psi Phi. The popular black fraternity was founded in 1911 at Howard University and was prominent on CU's campus in the 90s. Joshua's dad and uncle are a part of the fraternity, so his uncle made a call to his fraternity brother, Dayron Jasper, who works in CU's athletic department. And he was like, oh, he wanted to be Omega, but he didn't know at the time that Omegas were even around. And I had the opportunity to already kind of gauge, you know, kind of, I was like, oh yeah, I can see him fitting and how he can help. Working with Dayron and classmate T.J. Labrie, the trio attained provisional status on campus through fraternity and sorority life. The process took a year to complete, but when it was done in 2022, Omega Psi Phi officially became the first historically black fraternity to return and register at the University of Colorado in Boulder. I think it's important just to have the representation so that they can say, hey, I have the opportunity, I see it's there, and I, if I want to strive to, to be in that, then I have the opportunity to do that. Omega's four cardinal principles are manhood, scholarship, perseverance, and uplift. Joshua hopes to see more Omega men living that out on campus in purple and gold. I always having a brother to lean on, I always have someone to call. When things get tough, I can always do that, and that's just something that I think is the foundation of the, of the fraternity and something that we really rely on, and I really enjoy that.